Attention all boarding passengers. The express will soon be boarding for the Trans Mountain Run to Outpost 5. All digging equipment, explosives and firearms are to be checked as luggage. Track 2 is no longer in use and has been permanently abandoned. Alrighty, so we have an interesting theory coming out of Kings Island with the teasers that were released today at Cedar Point. So we all know now at this point that Cedar Point is releasing, releasing teasers for other parks in the Cedar Fair chain at their park. It started with Canada's Wonderland's teaser, which you just saw, which linked Adventure Express. So remember that name, Adventure Express. That clip we just played at the beginning of this video was from Adventure Express. And if you were watching the screen, it links that clip to this new teaser at Cedar Point. So that's interesting. I just want to take a moment to thank Emotional underscore Roller Coasters and BWB.32 on Instagram for sending me the sending me this information my way. Sending this information my way. Sorry, it is really late where I live. So um, I just had to make a video before going to bed. So we now have a teaser from Canada's Wonderland, Worlds of Fun, and now King's Island at Cedar Point, and we don't know what's next. There's obviously this extended universe of mining that Cedar Fair is building to link new attractions at the parks. So with that clip, it definitely links this whole King's Island theory to this new teasing poster, which links Son of Beast and RMC to a possible ground up RMC to replace the long lost Son of Beast. I know this is a huge stretch, but hear me out. So um, in 1993, actually we'll get to the 1993 poster in a bit, but if you go to HTTP, um, sorry, kingsislandextreme.com slash kitunes.php, track number three, that is the track you want to listen to that links you directly to this poster where it says track two is no longer in use and has been permanently abandoned. That is from, again, Adventure Express, and um, it links this whole... Cedar Creek Mining Company Expansion Plan Phase 1. Um, so in this teaser, it's extremely interesting. Again, we thought this was to do with Canada's Wonderland at first due to a few things listed in there and their location. But upon further um, investigation, it definitely sounds like this is linked to King's Island. So due to recent um, nearby discovery, it has been formally decided by... Beauregard Chamberlain, Chamberlain, sorry, <laughs> mining operations foreman, that construction and development of the 6919 site has been approved. This additional site will be fully operation, will be fully operation immediately. Wow, that's poor English. Uh, because of this um, change of plans, we are in need of st um, stalwart men with a full understanding of geology, paleontology, mechanics, anti-rollbacks, um, mid-course brake systems, chain dogs, and southern yellow pine care. Um, I definitely think the anti-rollbacks is a slight hint to RMC as well. Number 5 is Alive. That directly links Outpost 5 on Son of Beast Station, which is super interesting. Um... And uh, excavation of raw materials in conjunction with Sycamore Mining and Minerals Co. Um, after numeral, numerous years of searching, we have finally located the lost remnants of number five, so Outpost 5, and are formulating a plan, so they're in the formulation of a plan at the moment, to bring it back into service once again. This will increase the capacity in yield from the mines. That means less work for you. So very interesting information coming out of this teaser, teasing poster. Um, so as you just see right there, after numerous years of searching, we have finally located the lost remnants of number five, Outpost five, and we are formulating a plan to bring it back. So it's almost like they're telling you guys, the fans and us as Cedar Fair fans and coaster enthusiasts that look, Maybe we made a mistake on removing um, Son of Beast and not turning it into an RMC, or maybe that wasn't available at the time. I don't know. But it looks like they're finally looking into reviving that area and that coaster, maybe a ground-up RMC. Who knows? Um, but it's definitely another poster that you're about to see that leads me to that. But it's very interesting that Cedar Fair is linking all these parks to a lore of these, like, mining operations and this, like, battle of, like, 
Beauregard um, Chamberlain and like, you know, the three bandits that built Steel Vengeance um, and his brother. So the whole like no longer in use Outpost 5. Um, de it definitely links like this whole RMC theory, especially since Outpost 5 has been seen on Son of Beast Station. Again, Kings Island is not my home park, so I apologize if I'm screwing up any information and comment down below to correct me so I know for future videos. Um, so I'm looking at my facts here. So um, on this site, you see Bona Bonafield Barrel Co., Oak Strong and Iron Bound since 93. Mason Sandusky, barrels for all occasions. That is definitely a Kings Island teaser at Cedar Point right there. And um, it definitely, to me, Oak Strong and Iron Bound is a hint at an RMC as well. Now, there's an interesting date of 1993 on there. And my team and, um, I believe, BWB.32 um, in Discord definitely... Uh, came up with, so what happened in 1993 at Kings Island? Well, Top Gun was um, next to Son of Beast, and it was added, and then we have a ride removal of Wild um, Animal Habitat Monorail Ride. It was removed, and Adventure Express it occupied its station area, and Son of Beast took up a lot of its area as well for that ride. So it's all very interesting with all these links um, that are occurring on these teasers. It's a very interesting storyline. So I want to know, do you guys honestly think RMC Son of Beast is happening? Like, are they going to revive that whole theory that a lot of Kings Island and coaster enthusiasts have been, like, saying for the longest time? Is it finally happening? If so, that's awesome. Um, so uh, the next question is when? Well, we know RMC takes usually about two years to build, right? And my team at Amusement Insiders and I have definitely discussed when is Kings Island getting their next coaster? It's definitely not 2019. 2020 is Kings Island's year. I have said it in the past and I'm going to stick to it. Kings Island is definitely getting a coaster in 2020. Why? Well, Canada's Wonderland and Carowinds are getting a coaster in 2019. That's taken care of. Um, CGA is definitely getting a coaster in uh, 2020. Cedar Point is probably getting a coaster in 2020. And... Um, Kings Island's probably getting a coaster in 2020 at this point. Three parks isn't out of the question. Um, and to me, that sounds pretty logical. What do you guys think? Again, I'm trying to go over all the facts now as I have all the, all the information uh, written down. But it's definitely interesting that the Cedar Fair is going with this whole mining universe. So, again, just to go over the facts, you have Adventure Express in that quick audio clip at the beginning of the video. I'll post it at the end of the video, too, as well. So Adventure Express is station... Um, music and voiceover we removed the music for copyright reasons but the voiceover is interesting because it links it directly to that teasing poster that you guys just saw the storyline seems like it's going to be linked to some sort of mining expedition just like canada's wonderland which is super interesting um you have the whole adventure express has the theming and the in the tunnel is called track is closed and that is also linked onto the teasing poster and the whole um Extended Universe of Mining, No Longer in Use, Outpost 5, uh, definitely, definitely suggesting RMC of some sort or some sort of revival in that area. You know, the whole station, Outpost 5, this is a theming with mining. It, it's extremely interesting. Are all the parks going to eventually get some sort of, like, you know, Beauregard, Chamberlain-like themed coaster with mining and Cedar Creek Mining Co.? I'm surprised a lot more people aren't covering this topic with the teasers because, in my opinion, these teasers that are coming out of Cedar Point are probably the biggest thing to happen to Cedar Fair in a really long time. Um, I wish more people would cover it because I feel like more people covering it would give it, you know, the justice it deserves. We are just trying to understand these teasers ourselves at Amusement Insiders. And I have a feeling, you know, we're screwing up here, here and there. As you just saw, we thought this teaser was linked to Canada's Wonderland. And heavens no, it's linked to uh, King's Island. Um... But thank you again to Emotional Underscore Roller Coasters for this information and BWB.32. Um, exciting time to be a Kings Island fan and coaster enthusiast. You definitely have a great future ahead of you, especially since, you know, it's worded as, you know, number five is alive and Cedar Creek Mining Company expansion plan phase one. So what else is next? Anyways, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Hit the like button, subscribe if you haven't, share this video for others to see. And, uh, yeah, have a great one, guys. Thanks for watching again. Bye. Attention all boarding passengers. The Express will soon be boarding for the Trans Mountain Run to Outpost 5. All digging equipment, 
explosives and firearms are to be checked as luggage. Track 2 is no longer in use and has been permanently abandoned.